from the Warner Brothers Studios, here she is now. Anne Hathaway. Thank you, Anne. Welcome to the Anne Hathaway Show. Today we have a very special guest coming to you all the way from England, an economist who has written numerous books and has improved your economy. Please welcome John Maynard Keynes. Hi, John. Thanks for coming. Oh, no worries. This is a quite a lovely set you brought here. Why, thank you. So tell us, what's it like growing up in England? Oh, I loved it. I went to King's College, Cambridge University, and then, which led me to London School of Economics, which then I realized I would like to begin my economic theory. Fascinating. Would you mind briefly explaining that theory to us? Righto. Well, in short, when we spend more, we earn more, which leads us to an improved economy. And how do you feel about the government's role in the economy? Well, I believe that the government's part in our economy is vital and to make sure it runs smoothly. The, government's is, the government is needed to create jobs for us and to keep minimum wages and union continuing. I uh, briefly explain all of this in my book. Speaking of your books, we have one of them here. The General Theory of Employment, Interest, and Money. Tell us your process through writing this book. Well, it was a long, tedious cycle. Late nights filled with research, tea and crumpets. I was writing so much that night because it reminded me of my father and how he was very into economics, where he went to research in economics when he was in college. And I was very interested in money. That was my process. Wow, that sounds like a lot of work. Would you say it was worth it? Well, I would say so. I managed to uh, influence John Kenneth Galbraith. And we both decided that Lazy Fair was just rubbish. How do you feel about your opposing economists, the ones who do believe in Lazy Fair economy? Oh, Milton Freeman, Adam Smith, and Frederick. Those bloody bastards. Adam Smith, I'd smack him with my invisible hand. Wow, you seem very opinionated about this. Do your views on the free market differ as well? Well, we both strongly advocate free markets. However, this nonsense of lazy fair economy is completely rubbish. Whoever believes in lazy fair is obviously not being fair. The government needs to create jobs as well as intervene and stimulate the economy. Well, thank you for sharing your input. It's been wonderful having you here. Oh, well, it's been a jolly good sound. You've really got to come to London and see how lazy fare is just, oh, rubbish. <laughs> Keynesian's wonderful, but very nice to meet y'all. You too. Cheers, mate. Give it up for John Maynard Keynes, everybody. We can clearly see John's effect on our economy and through his influence on recent Democratic politicians, including President Obama, who have recognized and been utilizing the idea of Keynesian economics. Obama, like Keynes, believes in benefits of cutting taxes on lower income people. Well, that's the end of our show. Thanks for watching, and be sure to catch us next week where I will be interviewing Adam Smith on Laissez Faire.